Hey, what's up, guys? So it's uh, it's been a while since I've done an Android video. It's been a few months, so I wanted to show you a uh, quick video on the HTC Blink Fleet. Um, the port has become available over at XDA Developers, and so um, this is not the full Sense Six port or Next Sense is what they're calling it uh, for the Nexus line of devices. But what this is is this is the HTC Blink Feed, and this is going to act just like a home launcher. And I'll give you a, a quick show on how this works. So um, I'll provide a link in the description below for the zip. And so you're going to need to be rooted, and you're going to need to uh, have your custom recovery installed. And you're just going to flash the zip and custom recovery, and you'll be set to go. Um, so as you can see right now, I'm running the um, Google Experience Launcher. <clears throat> but if I uh, jump into my home here, and I am running Purity, um, just to show you real fast, I'm uh, running a Nexus 5 with the Purity build, and I'm um, running Franco Kernel on here. But if I jump into home, you'll see that I have HTC Blink Feed available. So if I go ahead and hit HTC Blink Feed and hit my home uh, navigation bar, um, I am now in Blink Feed. And, and this is going to be a, uh, a home launcher, and it's going to emulate um, exactly what the HTC One, it, One has. And as you can see, this is how I have Blink Feed set up over here. And I also have my Twitter link to it. Um, so you can see I have my Twitter link to it. I have uh, some sports in there, ESPN technology and whatnot and then uh, I have my highlights which is this and I can add additional content I can either search for the name and the search for content or I can hit the three dots right here and hit add content and then I can search to what's available and add it to my feed um, I'm not a big home watcher guy uh, I don't mess with Nova or Thema or anything like that but I gotta admit that I really do like the uh, HTC Blink Feed. I think it's a really cool setup on here. And of course, um, you can, you know, everything looks exactly how it's going to look on the HTC One uh, M8. <clears throat> so you have your home screen wallpaper. You can add widgets. Uh, you can change it on the different panels. And also, your menu is going to look the same, your app drawer. And it's going to scroll up and down uh, just like it does on the HTC One. And you can change the uh, the views, and and you can add. Uh, it, it's exactly the same, but uh, instead of being a full blown port, um, it's just going to be. Uh, it's going to act like a. Uh, um, it's going to act like a home launcher. Would I actually kind of like this better? Um, this way, um, just just my personal preference. And if I wanted to uh, further emulate the HTC devices, you can see that I have a custom navigation bar down here. If I jump into soft key Z, which I'll even provide a link below for soft key Z. If I jump into soft key Z here, this is where I change my navigation bars at. If I scroll over to where it says online gallery, you'll see actually the uh, second one down is going to be the HTC One M8 pack. And you can get all the uh, navigation uh, icons just like on the HTC One M8. And uh, you can further emulate uh, the, the HTC One. So I just wanted to give you guys that demonstration of HTC Blink Feed on the Google Nexus 5.